Hey, g'day my friends. I've got the uh, Border BF109 together, the um, the body part. So we've got the first parts together and it did it, it fit together really well. And there's a lot of things that have got to come together. So you see how these flaps work? So you've got to sort of put them in um, and they get held together by these two parts coming together. And then you can see it, that, that fits in okay. You've got a bit of gappage, but the um the wings will hide that I th i've built a smaller airplane before and it had the same sort of thing joins there but it doesn't join all the way and the uh engine things fitted in the right spot it all came out really good see they come in might have to move them a little bit oh no they're right it's like got a cover on that one, and no cover on that one. Oh, interesting. Strange. So, we've got a hell of a way into it. So what we've got to do now, and yeah, it, it, once again, it fits it together really well. I was really worried because you've got to put all these parts in, and yeah, and I've got the pilot done. He's really cool. He comes up really good. Getting a bit of light there or something. A bit of light pollution. I really am happy with how it's coming along. I was worried that this wouldn't come together. But you see, everything fits well. I'm gonna have to, you know, clean it up, of course. But I won't need to do any filling, it all fits together fine. See, no gaps. Even that, that this little part down here behind the wheel, that fitted in nice. So it's really good, so basically done step 13. And now we'll put the engine covers on. And uh, we'll get the you know, rest of these parts on. And then we can start building the wings. So I still haven't decided, but I think I'm going to go with uh, wheels up and I'll make a little stand for it. I think. I still haven't decided yet. So we'll do the flaps. We'll put the wings together and we've got to put our rockets in because I'm going to do the rockets, these rockets here, instead of the uh, cannons. That's a photo etch where you get to put so you got photo etch parts in the wheel base. That'll be nice. But most of the photo etch goes in these uh, rocket things. And that's where most of your photo etch is going. So if you're not doing the rockets, you basically won't be using your photo etch fret. And then they go in. So so far so good. It's it's actually been quite a fun build so far and I've had no problems apart from its self-created problems so all good I do recommend getting it now it is you know for the aeroplane fanatics it is a bit lacking detail in inside um, there's not much detail on the there's no gauges or anything there's just sort of holes there that you can paint white um, but as, as you see, you don't really see much inside. I went and got, went crazy on this figure and uh, did all this stuff. And then in the end, you don't really see a hell of a lot of him. But he's got his hand on the throttle and the joystick. And he's sort of looking into his sight. So he's about to launch an attack, I reckon, in the sky. So that's why I'll have to have the, wings, the wheels up, I reckon. But we'll see. All right, I'll speak to you again soon.